Hello. Good evening, everyone. Welcome. Nice to have you here. Okay. Kelly, and Alexandra, and Mario. Okay. In one minute, we're going to get started. Okay, class. Thank you, Danny, for being here. We were missing you yesterday. In a couple of seconds, we're going to get started. Okay. Let's see in the chat. Okay, Alexandra is in her way, okay? In the transportation. But very soon, she's going to be with us. Okay, Dani, great to have you here. We were missing you yesterday. Thank you, Miss. Good evening. Good evening, Ruth Guadalupe, welcome. Nice to have you here, guys, okay? Very, very well. Hmm, it's exactly the time to get started. Rose, no, Rose is not here yet. Hello, Ruth. Noe, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, everyone. You are really welcomed, okay? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How Good. was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo el día hoy? Look at Noah's face. Oh, you know. Out of office. Okay. Okay. Out of the office. Yes. Ah, uh, you were out so, and the weather very hot, y el clima bien caliente, yes? Very hot. Yeah, so probably at midnight it's going to rain, right? Like yesterday, you know, at noon it was very, very hot. Mediodía estuvo bien caliente, y luego en la noche, en la tarde, en la tarde, you know? Hello, Mario, thank you for activating the camera. And here we have Jose Mauricio. Okay, so we are going to get started because it is, uh, the time. Let's begin with the uh, presentation of my PPT because remember, every day we need more time, right? And even though, y aunque están bien cansadito y todo, pero ya cuando son las 10 de la noche y están en la práctica, quieren continuar, ¿verdad? Bien cansaditos. Okay, yesterday we had the one on one meeting with Noah, with Noé Vladimir, right? And today we're going to have, I expect that we can join. Uh, to the one-on-one -on -one session with Rosa, Rosa del Carmen. Today, it is her day. Hey, Jose Mauricio, you are at home very well. Ismael, welcome. We miss you yesterday too, okay? So let's take advantage of the connectivity. Welcome, welcome, Eric Ismael. And here we go, okay? So you are the stars now, class. And here we have, uh, let me see if I can share. Okay, yes, I can. Mm -hmm. So here we go. Um, the topic for today is how to use simple present information questions. And yesterday we began with this, right? If you will remember. So here we have that today we have our video conference number 12. In today's agenda, as every day, we have as activity number one, greetings, okay? All of you are really welcome to this uh, class. And we're going to read the objectives. We're going to have uh, as a pre-task, WH information questions. Asking WH information questions 
The preparation task is asking WH information questions about someone else's du duties at work. And we're going to work at pages 31 and 32 in our manual, okay? So as every day, I need a volunteer to help the class reading the specific objective and the class objective, okay? Who wants to try? Maybe Carla Daniela because she was absent yesterday. So she wants to participate probably. Okay. Yes. Okay, read please, Dan. Carla Daniela. Help us. Participants will be able to ask questions about someone else. Duties. Duties at the workplace. Class of the field. Participants will be able to use simple present information questions. Great, excellent. Thank you so much, Miss. I appreciate your participation. And here, remember um, about your homeworks for week number three. Week number three today is uh, Wednesday, right? And you are allowed, okay, to continue working in the platform for uh, homework number three. And now we go over the brainstorming. And here, again, you are going to participate because you are going to tell me what you remember we did yesterday in class, okay? The activities we practiced yesterday or the topic, okay? Something you remember about what we did yesterday, okay? Tell me, volunteers. Uh, WH questions. Okay, WH questions, right? Questions. Okay, very well. One more thing that you remember. Uh, teacher, the information questions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, because we can say first WH questions and WH information questions. Yes, information mm -hmm. questions. Okay, and one more thing besides that, the WH uh, information questions in simple present, yes? Because you can ask WH uh, questions in past tense too, but yesterday we worked in the simple present tense. So we say WH questions, information questions, right? Because you were asking about your partner's uh, duties at work. Information questions in simple present tense, correct? Okay. Uh, what else did you practice? Vocabulary? Vocabulary for the departments in a, in a company? Do you remember that? Human resources, what else? The ones that you were organizing and matching with the description or what the people do. Con la descripción de lo que la gente hace, los empleados hacen en cada departamento, en cada dependencia. ¿Te recuerda? Yes, we worked on vocabulary, vocabulary at work. Okay, some of the of the okay, I begin the vocabulary, the um, human resources, human resources department, yes or no? Okay, another one? Yes. Another one that you remember from your manual. that you work in the breakout rooms and you were discussing and discussing, no, this is not there for this department, this is for this one. Production. Production department, very well. Production department. Another one? Marketing. Marketing. Marketing uh, department. One more. Only one more. Uh, 
purchasing. Purchasing, okay, very well. Purchasing, the purchasing department, very well. You were working with this vocabulary yesterday. And now we move to, um, let me see. As a feedback, if you remember, we were working with um, what, when, where, why, and who at page 30, yes or no? So we're going to um, go over. Hey, but before we continue, Abel, good evening, Julissa, thank you for being here, Rose. Hello, Carla Elizabeth, welcome to this class, okay? All of you are really welcomed. And Jocelyn here, Julie, okay. Kelly, all of you and the other ones, I already said good evening. Ya les había dicho good evening. So here we go. Uh -huh. Let's begin. Um, if you remember class, as I told you, this is what we were practicing yesterday, right? the production department, research and development department, purchasing, as you mentioned, marketing department, human resources management department, accounting and finance department. And you were matching the different departments with the activities that people or the staff from that department perform, right? And also we were working with, um, this information, how to use the simple present information questions. And we had what, where, when, how, and what. Even though how doesn't begin with WH, fíjense que a pesar de que how no comienza con W y H, pero es considerada considerada en este grupo. ¿Por qué? Porque esta palabra how contiene las dos letras, no en el mismo orden que toda, ¿verdad? Pero sí. Entonces, sí la utilizamos para eh, hacer preguntas sobre información específica. Por ejemplo, what do I do? Mm, I supervise the production workforce. Where do you work? I work in the accounting department. Where do we go to meetings? We go to meetings two times a uh, week. Two times a week. It is not a week, a week, two times a week. How do they plan the marketing? They investigate the customer's needs. What time do you take breakfast? I take breakfast at 8 a.m. And here you were building these questions because you had the answers provided. Do you remember that? And here we have, you have to create questions with the WH words provided below. Then ask the questions to a partner. We began this yesterday, but we didn't have enough time in order to ask the questions. Yes or no? Do you remember? Se recuerdan que no tuvimos tiempo para hacer las preguntas a todos los compañeros del equipo. If I say, for example, um, these questions: What time do you um, have meetings? at work, for example. That could be my question. And if I say, um, Jose Mauricio, what time do you have? What time do you have meetings at work? Mm. I don't have meetings. I don't have meetings at work. Yes, I do. Okay, but what time? What time? Do you have meetings at work? Um, the time when you usually, la hora a la que usualmente tiene reunión en el trabajo. What time do you have uh -huh. meetings at work? At? At uh, nine, I, I a. A. M. Okay. A. M. At 9 a.m. But you may say in full answer, pero puede contestar en respuesta completa. I have meetings at 9 a.m. Yes? Okay. Yes. Okay, excellent. So this is the kind of questions that uh, you were supposed to be building and asking to your classmates. And when? Mm -hmm. When 
do you finish work or any other, right? Because for example, here you have some ideas. What do you do at work? And then you describe the activities. Where do you work? When do you go to meetings? How, how do uh, they plan the, the cells, okay? What time do you take breakfast? For example, what time do you have lunch? Because depending on the, on the company, they have different schedules. If it is in a bank, yeah, and if you are a, a, a teller at a bank, they take different, uh, different schedules to have lunch. Yes or no? Mm -hmm. Okay. And later here we have based on the questions, because number six, Create questions with the WH words provided below. Then ask the questions to a partner because you are going to create a role play. Van a crear una conversación corta. Pretend you don't know each other. No vamos a imaginar que no se conocen. So you ask questions about your department and duties. Van a hacerle preguntas a su compañero. Todas tienen que comenzar. What, when, where, why, who? Who is your boss? Who do you work with? Con quien trabajas? Who are your colleagues or your coworkers? Quienes son tus compañeros de trabajo? So you ask questions about your department and duties. Y hacemos preguntas relacionadas con nuestro trabajo. Duties, obligations, or activities that we perform at work. Sí, comprendimos. Las preguntas que vamos a crear acá las vamos a transformar en una conversación. Y luego, volunteers to share with the class here in this main session room. Y luego, un par de voluntarios para que compartan con la clase. Sí, only volunteers. Okay. Is it clear? Yes. ¿Estamos claros? No. Con las instrucciones 6 and 7. Hola, me escuchan. Hola, creo que perdí el audio. Vamos a verificar. Quiero ver aquí. Nadie me contesta. Perdí el audio. Me voy a salir de la, de la reunión y voy a reingresar porque creo que no, no, no me escuchan. No, 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 no. It, it, it is kind of weird because I listen to your, your, your you know, I listen to you smiling, okay? And I see you perfectly, but nobody says, okay? Primero van a crear una lista de preguntas en equipo, ¿sí? Y luego, pero eh, las preguntas tienen que ir en relación a las actividades, a las rutinas en nuestro trabajo. La, las obligaciones que tenemos, nuestras actividades diarias, ¿sí? Y cuando crean la lista de preguntas, luego comienzan asking and answering. Como que si no supieran lo que hacen, porque a esas alturas de, de la clase ya saben lo que hace cada quien y cómo lo hace y la frecuencia, ¿ok? So here we go. So you're going to have five minutes. And when we come back, pair of volunteers, un par de voluntarios to, to share with the class, para compartir con la clase, ¿de acuerdo? Okay, here we go. Let's say one, two, three. Let's verify how many. Okay, great. I'm going to open the breakout rooms. Voy a abrir los, los equipos de trabajo en este momento. So get ready and join your groups, ¿ok? Si tienen alguna pregunta y así en público no les gusta hacer las preguntas cuando estemos en los breakout rooms, ¿ok? Go to your groups, please. Go to your groups and write the list of questions. In practice, asking and answering. Eh, ayer nos quedamos en que íbamos a hacer las preguntas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is why Entonces, I, I tell you that when, hacer... when time flies, pero les digo que cuando el tiempo vuela, ¿verdad? Y solo se me quedan viendo así como que dice, aún no terminamos, pero ya es la hora. Ok. 
<risa> ok, hey, Alexandra. Welcome. Ok, bye. It is bye. information questions. Where, mm -hmm. what, why. Recuerden que siempre que preguntamos con <coughs> why es pidiendo una, uh, una razón. Why do, why do you work in that company? ¿Por qué trabajas en esa oficina? Why do you have meetings? ¿Por qué tienes reuniones? Because, se contesta con because, ¿verdad? Ok. Sí, Bye. Solo vamos a tener un diálogo de, y en ese diálogo para todos. Para sí. todos. Ah, correcto, así es un listado de preguntas y para que, es decir, tenemos la, la creación de la lista de preguntas, luego Carla le pregunta a Alexandra, Alexandra a Bela, a Bela a José y José a Carla. Uh -huh. Ok, ya. Yeah. Ok. Easy, easy. Piece of cake. Ya. Yeah. Remember that you have the reference in the manual. Ok, tienen la referencia en el manual. Ok, bye. Esa. Where do you work? ¿Dónde trabajas? Y después podemos colocar la que dice What time do you start to work? O sea, ¿qué horas este, empiezas a laborar? O sea, porque ya preguntamos primero Where do you work? ¿Dónde trabaja? Or department. 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 ¿Y qué más? Una cosa más que mm. And you visit the store. Company. <laughs> I visit the store company. And visit the store company. Read the question, Mario, again, please. What do you do at work? Okay. He works in porch department and purchase, 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 purchase department. department. Purchase. purchase department. And visit. And visit. And visit, visit, and visit stores. The stores. The stores. Store or the, the company stores. Store. The, store, the, the stores of the company. The oh, stores of the yes. company. And probably another one. When do you visit? When do you visit the stores of the company? Yes. Ah, okay. And he tells you maybe a Monday on Tuesday or the days. And uh, what time do you visit the stores of the company? In the morning, in the afternoon. Okay. So you okay. have a lot <laughs> to ask to know. Eh? <laughs> okay. Uh, entonces la segunda Mario sería es. When do you when do you visit? Ahorita vamos a formar con el what, el when, el where, el why y el who. No ah, solo bueno. están escritas, sino que a inventar. Sí. Bueno, hablar de nuestro trabajo. Sí. Sí. A mí se me ocurrió what time do you have a lunch? ¿En qué tiempo tienes tu hora de almuerzo? Está bien. ¿Ves por qué no podemos compartir la pantalla? Ajá, I took revenge. <risa> por no entrar ayer <risa> yeah. no, because nobody answered to me in the, uh, very ah. early today because I was talking in everybody in silence <risa> you say no, no, yeah, and, and yeah. the thing is that you, you feel like you are, you are uh, losing the connectivity, right? Yes. así se siente <risa> ok sí, <se> siente. <risa> real, kind of real <risa> that you are the problem mm -hmm. Okay, now you can share that <laughs> because nobody, nobody asked me and I forgot. But now you, you can do it. Okay. okay, thank you. No revenge, no hard feelings. Okay. 
oiganme, no es conversación, sino que es solo un listado de preguntas y se las tienen que hacer unos a otros. Sí, es como sí. que usted vaya pasando. No es conversación en sí, no hemos llegado todavía a la conversación, así que van a estructurar. Solo es el listado de preguntas porque el punto acá es que sepan estructurar preguntas con WH questions. No se compliquen tanto todavía, no hemos llegado con los insumos que tengan, que van a generar en este momento. Pues pasamos a esto, ¿sí? Ah, ok, step by step. step. Oh, yes, of course. Step by step. For okay. example, teacher, the mm -hmm. one question is, uh, what time do you have a lunch? Yes, what time do you have lunch? And then if you ask Abel, Carla, what time do you have lunch? And she mm -hmm. tells you the answer. I have lunch, blah, blah, blah. And then Carla asks Jose Mauricio, Jose Mauricio, what time do you have lunch? And he answers. And then Jose Mauricio asks Alexandra, Alexandra, what time do you have no, lunch? He, yeah, yeah. And Alexandra asks Abel, yeah. The idea is that all of you practice and also you are going to practice here writing the construction, la construcción de las information questions con WH, ¿verdad? En presente simple, y la estructura y también el speaking. Después ya vamos a, con esa información que ya tengan, ya vamos a construir la conversación, pero es otra etapa, ¿ok? Ok. okay. okay. Carla Elizabeth is having problems. With her internet. Ay, el internet en el salva. El internet en nuestro país es a problem, right? Listen. Ok. Cada uno puede crear una pregunta, ¿sí? Y así, es cortita, solo es de repaso. Porque luego ya llegaremos en la production. For real. Ok. What time do you have lunch? Ella le puede preguntar, what time do you start to work? O sea, ella le puede hacer uh -huh. la pregunta después uh -huh. de que usted le responde. Uh -huh. Entonces sería, uh -huh. I work in, ¿dónde trabaja Ruth? Uh -huh. I work in for family. ¿Dónde? por familia. Fundación Esperanza para las Familias. Fundación de Esperanza para las Familias. Hope for Family. Hope for Family. H O P E. Ya. Yeah. Hope for families. Para las familias. Ya. Yeah. Hope for families. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, and it is an NGO in English, non governmental organization, right? NGO, non governmental organization. Okay. In Spanish, ONG. Yeah? ONG. But in English, NGO, non governmental organization. Okay. Okay. Entonces ahora yo le pregunto a Ruth, what do you what do you start to work? Uh, sí, así se Porque acá, como ya me refiero, está Carla Elizabeth también, ok, que participe ella también. Okay. Ajá, es que eso queríamos. Ah, entonces ahí, ahí sí. sí. This is qualities of items. Items es, es como de las. O oh, 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 también podemos. Quality control. Hacer... Quality control. Oh. No. <laughs> Or no. 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 
the the only the quality of the I I know where you work, the quality of the of the items. The area. No items, de los productos. Ah, de los productos. sí, items. yes, yes. Okay, so you say items. like this, quality items. And here. Items. Ajá, uh -huh, yeah, quality <laughs> items. It is quality control, quality items. Items. Teacher, and, uh, yes. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, he visits the store of, the store of company. Because he, ¿cómo decir? Como él ve la calidad he, de los productos. Okay, he checks the quality oh, items. He checks the quality items, yeah? In order to classify, okay? In order to be classified correctly and also the price, yes? Is that correct? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Very well. Teacher, uh, yes. how is for no oh, how para qué se ocupa es cómo o quién no how who is for people for example who is your boss okay oh, if we say who is only for people who is for people. Uh, you may say, who is your boss? Mm. ¿Quién es tu jefe? Who are your co-workers? ¿Quiénes son tus compañeros de trabajo? Yes? Mm -hmm. Who are your co-workers? Um, es que me, nos habíamos confundido con el how. How? H -O. H O W H O W How do you do? How do you do? ¿Cómo estás? Mm -hmm. Ajá. How do okay. you How do you get to work? Oh. ¿Cómo uh, llegas al trabajo? You may say I um, I, I travel by bus. Mm -hmm. For example, or I Walk to work. Yo camino porque me quedo cerca. Yes. Mm -hmm. I walk to work. I or drive to work. I, I drive to work. To work. Okay. Oh, or I, I ride my motorcycle to work. Yeah. Oh, I run. I, oh, that, is, that would be better because you're exercising. I ride my my motorcycle my motorcycle to work okay different transportation means okay how do you get to work mm -hmm. how do you feel at work for example como te sientes en el trabajo I feel nice comfortable I like it yeah and who is only for people Okay. 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 Ready? Finish. Almost. 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 Casi almost. A L M O S T. Almost. Casi. Almost. Almost. Yeah. Domingo. Entonces, ¿cómo sería? Ah, pues podemos poner con Bye, Mauricio. Bueno, Finish. ¿Por qué Mauricio no descansa? Finish. Es que vamos por Guay. Para only no, five questions. What? No, para only five questions. Solo cinco preguntas. ¿En you are poor? Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> the question is, uh, what do you do at work? When do you have a meeting? 
where do you work? Mm -hmm. And the last one. Why do you why do you like your work? Why do you like your work? Porque te gusta tu trabajo. Because I don't know, like it work. It's an, for el dinero. It's for the because of, of the payday, payday. Because of the payday. <laughs> because of the salary. Okay. Okay, two more minutes. Okay. Bye. Preguntándole, que, preguntándole por qué tiene... Reunión eh, todos los jueves. Reuniones todos Así, los jueves. ¿verdad? Ya terminaron las preguntas. Ya yes, no. he Las cinco preguntas que tenían que estructurar. La estamos, las estamos Cuatro, estructurando ¿no? y... Sí, ya pero ya... ya sí, pero, sí, pero, sí, pero solo son las cinco preguntas. Ya tienen diez minutos de estar en esto. Ya deben de haber terminado las cinco preguntas. No íbamos a hacer la conversación de una sola vez, Ticha. ¿Cuál conversación? Tenían que hacer las cinco preguntas y luego se las hacían a sus compañeros entre todos. Esa era la conversación que tenían que crear. Porque si no, no van a saber cómo utilizar las WH questions. ¿Verdad? Están practicando las estructuras. Y la conversación es, usted le pregunta a Ruth, Ruth le pregunta a Rosa, Rosa le pregunta a Carla y Carla le pregunta a Julissa. Esa es la conversación. Mm, teacher. Pues no sí, no, sí, ah, pues sí, teacher, ya la tenemos. Lo que pasa es que nos confundimos y estábamos haciendo una conversación, no, o sea, es que, escribiéndola. No, no, ¿y por qué van a hacer la conversación si no tienen modelo todavía? En este punto mm. estamos repasando la estructura de las WH questions. Okay. Y ahí está clara la instrucción, el manual, que es lo que yo les repetí, porque si no, no van a saber cómo estructurar, ¿sí? No van a poder preguntarle a nadie sobre su rutina en el trabajo, ¿ok? Ok, dicho. Ok. Don? Yes. Yes. Okay, very well. Let's get back then to the main session room. Regresamos a, al salón principal, ¿de acuerdo? Bueno. Eh, mm. Mario. <laughs> You're going to interview one another. Eh, no, solo la, la última pregunta estaba copiando ya. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál es la cuarta, Mario? La cuarta es, why do you visit the store of your company? Ah, ok. Why do you visit the store? Uh -huh. Aquí tengo dos más. Um, eh, the answer is, is the, answer the answer is, he visits the store of his company because he checks uh, the quality items. The quality items, ok, very well. And the items. other two, the other two questions. The other is, who is your boss? Who and is... he say, his boss is CEO because his information classified. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, the, 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 the manager of the store, or I don't know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. No, la no, última is, <laughs> is how do you get at work ah. how how? Mm -hmm. how do you get at work okay yes, I, okay. And I you said travel. he travels by bus by bus okay excellent very well okay. finish okay <laughs> great let's get back then okay Let's wait for the rest of the partners. And now it's time for sharing, okay? There is one group, group number two is still in there. Pero la plataforma los traerá.
Bellacomin. Okay, here we go. Activate your cameras before we go over the activity. I'm going to take your attendance, okay? The first one, Abel. Present. Thank you. Alexandra Michel. Present, Miss. Thank you, Miss. Carlos, no, he's not here. David is not here. Eric Enrique, uh, he's working. Eric Fernando, working too. Eric Ismael. Mm, absent, but for a moment he was here. Griselda. Griselda is not here. So you are witness, my witness. Okay, so Mr. Steele, okay, yeah, yeah, me Griselda, and she was not here. <laughs> Javier is not here. Jocelyn? Jocelyn? Was Jocelyn here? No, she wasn't, right? Okay, Jocelyn was not, is not here. Jose Mauricio? What? Jose Mauricio? Nice. Okay. Julissa. Present. Thank you. Carla Daniela. Present. Carla Elizabeth. Present. Kelly? Present. Thank you, Miss. Thank you for being here besides your sick. Mario? Perdón, Miss. Hi, Miss. Okay. Perdón, me sacó la plataforma o el internet, no sé. La plataforma no creo. El internet. No, yo creo que el internet. Porque todos estamos acá. Pero mire, cuando eso pasa, nos pasa. En la sesión queda acá y reingresamos, ¿verdad? Ok, no hay problema. Ok, yes. Um, Noé. Present. Rosa. Rosa. Present. Present. Okay. Ruth, where are you, Ruth? Are you here in this virtual world? Present. Excellent, very well. So, um, Jose Mauricio, you are here, yes. Yeah. Sí, por eso. Yeah, and Jocelyn is not here, unfortunately. Okay, we have our stars at this moment for the conversation. And here we go. <clears throat> Let's clap for the icebreakers of this activity. Noah, Noé, Vladimir, and Mario, you are the stars. So, so begin, please. Who's going to interview the other one? ¿Quién realizará las preguntas? Hello, teacher. Hello. Eh, yo voy a hacer las preguntas y Noé va a responder. Okay, great. You ask the questions and Noah answers. Begin. Okay. So, what do you do at work? I work for six departments and visit the store of the company. When do you visit the store of companies? I visit the store of company on Wednesday and Friday. Where do you work? I work in premium center. What do you visit the store of the company? I visit the store because check quality earrings. Who is your boss? My boss is CEO. How do you get at work? I travel by bus. Thank you. Finish. Finish. So much. Excellent. Very well done. And now we're going to have, thank you because everybody was practicing. So now we're going to have another feedback 
And it goes like this, okay? Let me see here. This is what you helped me to do. And this is what we did. But right now we're going to have the following. Where does, okay? She works, what does, okay? Where does, blah, blah. He belongs to, why do you belong to? Because I, okay? So we're going to complete these uh, sentences. And let's see who's going to be here. Ah, Eric Ismael is here. Okay, very well, welcome. Okay, class, here, as I told you, you are going to help me in the completion of this, okay? So over here, hmm. let's see. Where does, tell me. Where does, she she yeah, works. but who is he? Who, tell me the name. Where does? Gabriela. Okay, uh, but do we have a Gabriela here? Because we're going to ask the questions ah, okay. to that person. Uh -huh. Where does? Daniela. Okay, where does Daniela? Where does work. Daniela work? And then the answer is, where does she work? She works. She works in. In. in? Um, Excuse me. Almacén. Almacén. Almacén Pacífico. Yes. Pacífico. Yes. Uh, what does? She do. What does she do? She. Okay, she sells uh, fabrics. Fabrics. Uh, where does? Where does she belong? Where does she belong to? She belongs to. She belongs to the, tell me the department that she belongs to, to the sales department. No, a uh, uh, que departamento perteneces, where does mm -hmm. she belong to, okay? Now, um, let's see. Mm. Abel. Yes. Where do you belong to? I sell department. Sales department. Also at the sales department. Okay, so we say he belongs to the sales department. Sales department. Okay. He belongs to sales department. Now um why do you belong to sales department? This question, okay. Why do you belong to sales department? ¿Por qué perteneces a ese departamento? ¿Por qué estás en ese departamento? Yes? Mm -hmm. yes. And now, what is your answer? Because I... Because I best I, the... I am? Because I best the... Um, I am a sales, I am a sales mm -hmm. person. Yes? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you mention your profession or occupation, right? Okay. Okay. So here we're working with information questions in simple present and also the answers. And remember that yesterday the topic was, where do you belong to? If you remember, yes? And you were saying the department or area that you belong to in your company. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Yes. Where does she belong to? Very well. And now we continue with this. But I'm going to share it to stop sharing here because I wanted to see it magnified.
This is what we were doing before, right? It was about the daily routine and here we continue. The structure, and that is why I ask you to practice building questions. Porque el manual les pide que practiquen construyendo preguntas WH information questions, la actividad que hicieron anteriormente. So what, WH do or does plus the subject plus the verb and complement. Why do you work there? What do you do, okay? What does she do? Yes? And now, these are just no questions. Practice, information questions. What? What is used to ask for information about something? Lo utilizamos para preguntar, para obtener información acerca de algo. Por ejemplo, what is your name? What is also used, también utilizamos what, para hacer preguntas, para buscar información, confirmación o repetición de alguna actividad para rutinas. Por ejemplo, what is your daily routine? Es algo repetitivo, constante, ¿sí? Where is used to ask about a place or location. Where do you live? Where do you work? Where do you have lunch? Where do you have breakfast? I have breakfast at home. I have breakfast at work, yes? Who mm -hmm. is used to ask about people? Who is exclusivamente para preguntar sobre personas. Puede ser en singular o en plural, siempre es who, okay? Who, who is, is your boss? Is who are you? Who are your brothers? Who are your parents, yes? Who are your mm -hmm. colleagues? Who are your co-workers? Who are your children? ¿Quiénes son tus niños? Yes? Why is used to ask about a reason or a motive. Utilizamos mm -hmm. por qué para preguntar por un motivo o una razón. Why are you doing that? Porque estás haciendo eso. Yes? Because. Just because. Solo porque sí. Just because. Solo porque sí. Yes? Porque sí. Just because. Why do you work in that company, for example? Hmm? Because I like it, because I love to work there, yes? Because I am so motivated to work there. Siempre que preguntamos con why, contestamos con because. Nos preguntan con why, nosotros contestamos con because. ¿De acuerdo? Okay, questions about this? Information? Knock, knock. Is somebody here with the teacher or nobody is here or no questions? Excellent. Everything is perfect. Perfectly understood. Todo es perfectamente comprensible. Entendido. Oh my God. Excellent class. I'm so proud of you. <clears throat> extremely, extremely proud of you. Yes, very well. Excellent. And now that we have that information, y ustedes practicaron mucho en los breakout rooms, construyendo preguntas, information questions, ¿verdad? Preguntaron, hicieron muchas preguntas, así como Noé y Mario lo hicieron. Entonces, um, vamos a continuar con la práctica. And then we continue with our manual. And here we go, okay? Ask some classmates about the duties they have to perform at their workplace and share. That is what you did before. So now it is the time to ask questions about someone else's duties at workplace. Vamos a hacer preguntas acerca de la rutina de alguien más. Duties, obligations, or activities you have to do at work, okay? Actividades que tienen que hacer en el puesto de trabajo. Listen to your teacher. Read the conversation. They practice with a partner. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? 
Sure. What is it about? Sure. What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Quiere que en su tiempo libre le ayude, right? And then we have here Kevin and Albert. So I need two volunteers in order to help me reading right now, okay? okay. Thank you, Abel. You are going to be Kevin and I need another volunteer to read Albert. Only one more. Abel is going to read Kevin. Who's going to read Albert? Because you have to read, you have to practice. Okay, Rose, thank you representing the ladies team. Rose, very well. Okay, here we go. You begin, Abel. Okay, what do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Right? Because I need some to help to help me move some boxes. Can you do? Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is what is it about? What does Mr. Reed have to do? that day i'm not so sure what time does he finish to work on thursday or when does we have free time okay excellent thank you for your participation so here <clears throat> what do you have to do on thursday i just this you sounds like an a I just checked the production, production for the new product and write a report about it, about it together. Juntas esas dos palabras, about it. Why? Because I need someone, someone. I need someone, someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure, sure. What is it? What is it about? What is it about? What is it about? Um, what does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Okay. Instructions. Okay. Let's be clear about the instructions. Clarifiquemos las instrucciones. Now you have listened to the teacher read the conversation. It is the time for you to practice with a partner in the breakout rooms because we have the model of the conversation. Uh, Rose and Abel model the conversation for you. Now you move to the breakout rooms and you practice this conversation, but also you are going to create at this moment right now, one conversation similar. What are you going to do? You are going to change, for example, the day. What do you have to do on Monday or, or on Wednesday or on Friday? Yes. And then you mention here your real activity that you do at work that day. Y acá mencionan la actividad que realizan exactamente ese día. Uh, and then I just check blah, 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 or you say, why? Pero siempre van a terminar esta, este parlamento con why. ¿Por qué? Because I need, y aquí continúa, right? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure, what is it? What does Mr. and you change the last name of the person? It must be a boy. Okay, Mr. Tiene que ser un él porque necesita que le ayuden a mover cajas. Maybe, okay? And they are kind of heavy, I think. I'm not so sure. What time does he finish? Y continúa la conversación. Cuando ustedes switch roles, intercambien roles, entonces van a decir, acaban a cambiar la actividad. 
porque yo no hago lo mismo que hace Carla Daniela, ni Carla Daniela hace lo mismo que hace Ruth ese día, ¿de acuerdo? ¿Sí? ¿Captamos? ¿Estamos claros? Yes. Ok, now yes, very well. And when we finish this, porque tienen que practicarlo primero tal cual como está, luego hacen los cambios necesarios, intercambian roles y pro, proseguimos acá. Read the conversation again and circle or underline the correct word in bolds. Then answer the question. Okay? What do or does Albert have to do on Thursday? And based on this information, you write here the answer. Vamos a contestar estas preguntas en base a esta información y seleccionan de acuerdo al sujeto de la oración si es do or does, ¿ok? Yes. Am I alone? Ah, oh, Ismael is here. Very well. So let's see, let's recreate. Ok, recuerden, si, si hay tres en un equipo, intercambian roles y le dan espacio a la otra persona también, ¿verdad? Eh, va a quedar tres por si hay problemas de conexión para que no se queden lonely de lonely y solamente hay un equipo con, con dos participantes, porque así lo, lo ha enviado. No son dos. Eh, permítanme, vamos a recrear esto nuevamente, no voy a hacer qué. Ok. Let's verify. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Go to your groups and begin with the practice. Go to your groups and begin the practice. Mm -hmm. Okay, here you are. Ah, oh, piece of cake for you. Both of you. <laughs> kind of, kind of, more or less. Okay, bye. Uh, Danny, make him practice as much as possible, okay? Haga que ese chico practique lo más posible, ¿de acuerdo? Si es posible que lea él more than once toda la conversación. Okay, thank you. Bye. Mm -hmm. Pero si no, no lo abro. Um, no lo tengo. Me gusta que, que les muestre, que les muestre eh, la imagen y toma un screenshot. Si no tienen disponible, sí, de la conversación. Okay. Here we go. Okay, there you are with the conversation, right? Ay, but hold it, hold it. Mm, I'm going to, be, I don't want to be there. Okay, like that. <laughs> Because, <laughs> es que cuando, cuando le tomo un screenshot ya me he visto que salgo como salgo en la foto. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, now uh, for the questions. Okay, another mm -hmm. screenshot, but hold it. Not yet. <laughs> okay, now. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, my pleasure. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing. There you are. Let's see who is saying. Kelly. Kelly is sick. Okay, yes, yes, I know that you, you were diagnosed with COVID. Okay. So thank you for being here. But they are going to represent you very well. Okay. Pero lo, la van a representar muy bien. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Ok, lean la conversación por completa, de ser posible cada uno lee toda la conversación y luego la, la hacen en pareja, ¿verdad? Para que tengan mayor práctica. Okay. Sí, solo que tendríamos que cambiar la información por la uh -huh. nuestra. Sí, pero la, la pueden practicar tal cual como está en este momento para que tengan más práctica, ¿sí? Y luego ah. cambian la, la de ustedes. Ok, but it's up to you, ok? okay. You decide the methodology. Thank okay. you. Ay, bye. What is it about? 
what does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Kevin. Alberto. Albert. Porque ya fui Albert. Eso. Uh, <laughs> what do you what do you have to do on Thursday? I I jobs I I uh, perdón. I jobs check the production for the meat production and write the report about it why. Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? What does Mr. Reese have to have to do that day? I am not so sure. What time does he finish to work? on Thursday or when does he have free time? <clears throat> okay, I'm going to read it for you once. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Puedes hacerme un favor. Can you do me a favor? Okay, Alexandra, repeat after me. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? No. Can you do me a favor? Can do you? No, me? do you know? Do you know? Can you can do? You do uh, can you do me a favor. a favor? Okay, pero toda la oración junta. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? Very well. Ahora repita, Alexandra, después de mí. Repeat after me. Write a report about it. I what? No, write, write a report about it. Acá arriba, write a report about it. ¿A dónde? Ah, ah en, en la segunda. Ok, uh, no, pero está arriba, eh, al inicio de la conversación. Write a report about it. Write a write, report about it. Write a report about it. About it. About it. About Esta it. te suena como que fuera R, R. About it. About it. About about it. Write a report about it. Write a report about ¿Cómo es? Perdón. About it. About it. About it. Excelente. About, about it. it. Yes. Y acá about si se fija it. hay un punto porque ahí nos detenemos. Uh, y luego, why, por qué, why. Oh, I why? just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Okay. And then because I need someone, someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? Okay, what is it? about, what is it, what is it about, punto, what is it about, sure, what is it about, yes. okay, y ahora quiero escuchar a Ruth, okay. Ruth en, con quién va a leer Ruth, creo que es conmigo, o no, con Alexandra, ok, great, eh, quién es Kevin y quién es Albert, Ruth, eh. pues claro, está bien, Okay, ¿Cómo? Ruth is Kevin. Ruth is Kevin. Okay. okay. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new pro product and write a report about it. Why? About it. About, about it. it. 
because um I need some some no to someone 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 to help me to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? What about, is it about? about what about, is about, it? Uh -huh. about, about. About. What, what does Mr. Ruiz, Ruiz have to do that day? I am not so sure. What time does he finish to work on the Tuesday? Or when does he have free time? Amen. Very well. Okay, now you replace the day and the activity. Substituyen el día. Y la actividad, dependiendo a quién le hacen la pregunta, dice una o dos actividades que realiza ese día. Ok, your duties. Ok. Ok, continue. Bye. Trata sería esa, ¿verdad? Porque, o sea... O podría ser otra acción en vez de eso. Teacher, I have a question. Este, le, lo que íbamos a cambiar era únicamente esto. El o, día de la sea, semana, el día de la semana and the duties. Y las obligaciones o actividades porque van a escribir las reales de ustedes que hacen ese día. Una o dos nada más. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, entonces sería el día de la semana que sería Thursday uh -huh. y esto. Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, teacher. Ok. Ah, okay. oh, pues sí, eh, Eric, eh, lo demás lo podríamos dejar así, solamente le podemos cambiar el... el... Uh, Diego Vidal, Vidal, perdón, Vidal, Bueno, ensayémoslo. Usted okay. Albert, y después cambiamos. Okay. What do you have to do on Monday? I have set uh, the production. No, no, no. Ahora ya ah. es nuevo. Leemos la ya... Ah, ¿Ah? Sí, sí, perdón. I just made call and take call. Why? Sure. What is it? What is it about? What does Mr. Vidal have to do that day? Um, I'm not so sure. sure. What time does he finish to work on Monday or when does he have the time? <laughs> Ahora hay que pensarlo de mi lado. Ahora usted tendría que preguntarme, digamos, el mismo día para que no nos perdamos. Ok. Y yo le Eh, Ahí sería, what do you have to do on Monday? What do you have 
to do on Monday? Monday? I just supply my favorite furniture. Why? Because I knew someone to help me uh, move, move some boxer. Can you do me a favor? What, what does Mr. Vidal? I think so, but if you want to leave Mr. Vidal, that's okay. Because it is someone else's routine. Es la rutina de alguien más. Para que no se confunda Mario. Perdón, José Mauricio. Mario. Ah, ayer me dijo Noé Mario también. Y yo, ah. Ah, ah, es que Mauricio solo medio le y estaba pensando sí, yo en con esto. mi ceguera solo veo M y deduzco que dice Mario también. A ver si <ríe> sí, porque más. Mario y Mauricio, ¿okay? <ríe> I'm not so sure. What time, what time does he finish, finish to work on do that day? <laughs> I am not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Monday or when does he have free time? Okay. Okay. Sí. Entonces, terminamos con eso. ¿Ya? Supongo que sí. ¿Hola? ¿Cómo pone que sí? Okay. Vaya. Entonces... Ahora tocaría seguir con estos. La parte de abajo seguimos. La parte de tres. Ajá. Acá, según la conversación, íbamos a, a responder, creo. Uh, sí. Ah, sí, 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 dice la ticha. Read the conversation. Que leamos la conversación y luego después lo Teacher, solamente vamos a colocar si es do o das o, o, o la. Respuesta no, no, sobre no. Eso. listen, read the conversation. Again, to circle the correct word in bolts para seleccionar el auxiliar que corresponde de acuerdo al sujeto, al sujeto de la oración. Then, okay. luego, answer the question. Y acá van a contestar las preguntas. ¿Sí? Ah, ok. 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 Uh -huh. Mm. Y después iría Or Where does she care? Al final de word Ponemos siempre el Signo de interrogación Ajá, el signo de interrogación De pregunta uh -huh. or, or when Does she alive, alive, alivio, teacher hope this say alivio, de sentirse aliviado. Relief, relief. Relief. Yeah, like this. When does she relief? Relief. 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 Or when does she relieve? Así está bien. Teacher, le podemos decir la oración y nos dice si está bien. Ok. Vale. ¿Estás listo? Yes. A ver. Yes. La conversación van a decir. Sí. Uh -huh. eh, 
what do you have to do on Monday in order? No, hay, Abel inicia. No sé. Uh -huh. <laughs> what do you do and have, have to do on Monday? I have to do the plane of month and do the presentation. Why? Because I need someone to help me and send emails. Can you do can you do me a favor? Of course. What is what is about? What does Miss Kelly have to do that that day? Mm, I'm not so sure. What day does she come do the work or when does she relieve? Así sería. Ajá, sí habíamos pensado, teacher. O cuando ella se siente que. Repita en esa última parte. When does she. Or when does she relieve? Re, Pero ahí, ¿cuál es la, 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 la intención de, de, de relief? Cuando ella se siente aliviada. Ajá, como cuando ella se recuperó. Como ella está enferma. Ah, entonces no. Ahí oh. tendría que ser when she feels better. Ah. Ajá, when she oh. feels better. Porque si yo le digo, ay, what a relief. I felt relieved, por ejemplo, de, de, de un problema o de la lluvia. Ah, what a relief. It stopped mm. raining. Sí. Que alivio, dejó de llover. Mm -hmm. When she feels mm -hmm. better. Mm -hmm. Ok. Does she? When she feels. Feels. Ok, I'm going to write it over here. I'm going to share my screen with you. Or when does she feel better? No, oh, o cuando, she... pero cuando se sentirá ella mejor, Ay, uh -huh. no se sabe. Por eso pregunto. Or when, or when she feels, pero como vas a, o, o cuando ella se sienta bien, or when she feels better, pero ahí no tiene que ser, when does she feel better, porque le tiene que preguntar a ella, do you feel better? Or when she feels better, o cuando ella se sienta mejor, ¿ya? Pero no uh -huh. sería en este sentido pregunta. Or when she feels better. O cuando ella se sienta mejor. ¿Ok? Sin tú. Nos pregunta. Oh, Ajá. Si, sin la pregunta. El Solo question mark. Ya yeah? no question mark. No, no, no does. Or oh. when. Uh -huh. Because if you say. Uh, uh, when does she feel better. Cuando se siente ella mejor. Ya. Yeah? No. Cuando ella se sienta mejor. Uh -huh. Because you don't know when is, it is going to happen. When she feels better or when she feels better. Better. Yes. Okay. And remember to, to answer the questions. Okay. Okay. And here, remember, guys, you only have to choose the best according to the subject of the, of the sentence, the best modal auxiliary, if it is do or does. Mm -hmm. And when you do that, you answer the questions. Okay. Based on the conversation you have here. Considerando la información que tienen acá en la conversación, van a contestar estas preguntas. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Ok, great. Ok. Because he needs more some boxes. Ah, no, es lo que necesita. Boxes. He needs to move some box, some one boxes, no some boxes. Uh -huh. Sin solo... single one. Some. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Y antes del need. No. No, antes... después del, del move. No. No. 
between entry, between needs and move, you insert a two, T-O. Two. Uh -huh. uh -huh. He needs to. Uh -huh. He needs to. He needs to move. Move some boxes. Some boxes. That's correct. Excellent. Okay. Okay. How, how do you think it's going to help? How do you think? Hice una pregunta. Hola. Una pregunta a la mía aquí en esta respuesta de ah. las tres. Le pregunto yo a ella. Do you think it's going to? Siento que la pregunta dice que como que quién ayud quién ayudará, quién crees que ayudará a Kevin. Uh -huh. Entonces, la, mi respuesta, no sé si estoy equivocado, sería Mr. Ruiz. Mr. Ruiz, Ruiz, because the other one is not going to, is not going to do it, because he doesn't say, I'm, uh, okay, I can help you. No le dice, si sí, te puedo ayudar. So he's going to wait until Mr. Ruiz is available. So Mr. Ruiz, I think, yes. Okay. Yeah. Mr. Yeah. Ruiz. Yeah. The risk will help Kevin. Why? Okay. Okay. Mr. Reese is going to help Kevin. He's going to help Kevin. Sorry, Mr. Reese. Okay. Okay. Mr. Is going. He's going to help Kevin. He's going to help. Is going to. Okay, see, see. Uh, she has to help. Kevin, okay. capital letter. Kevin, capital letter. Kevin, capital letter. And finally, sería what Mr. Rees do on Thursday? Que hace Mr. Rees lo jueves. Sí, jueves. Uh, aquí ya no sé qué fue. Pues, eh. <laughs> En esta última nos hemos quedado. What does Mr. Ruiz do on Thursday? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I'm not sure, porque acá dice no estoy seguro. Uh -huh. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? Uh -huh. I'm not sure. No estoy seguro. No está seguro. Ni de nosotros tampoco. He not at all. Okay, uh, what uh, does uh, Mr. Ruiz do on Thursday? Uh -huh. No, acá está la respuesta. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Porque Albert no está seguro ni nosotros porque no sabemos. So mm -hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Pero como sure. nosotros estamos respondiendo sería... Oh, he is not sure. He is not sure. Porque usted está reportando lo que dice Albert. He is not sure. Pero aquí no le está preguntando qué es lo que va a hacer el jueves. Él no sabe qué va a hacer el jueves, por eso dice I'm not so, so sure. No estoy muy seguro porque le preguntan a... A Albert, ¿qué va a hacer alguien más? ¿Qué es lo que el señor Ruiz va a hacer? Es como que yo le diga, no es, ¿qué es lo que Ruth va a hacer el jueves? Si usted me dice, I'm not sure, porque usted no sabe lo que ella va a hacer, ¿sí? Por eso escriben acá, he is not, he isn't so sure, or Kevin, no, Albert, Albert isn't so sure, para ser más, más específico, pues. Ok, entonces, en lo de arriba, Ruth, 
donde dice Mr. Ruiz en la conversación. Ajá. En la conversación. No en la conversación. Ah, perdón. No tendría que ir así. Porque ahí estamos hablando de otra persona, no de Albert. Aquí no debería ir así. Okay, no. hold it. Espérense. What Ajá. do you have to do on Monday? I have meeting. I have a meeting in the morning and check the WhatsApp work. Why? I just check the production for the new blah blah blah. Okay, because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it? What does Mr. Blanco have to do that day? No, ahí está bien. Está I'm bien. not so sure. What time does he finish to work? Sí, está bien. Ok. Porque acá no, le, no está preguntando de Albert ni de Kevin, está preguntando de alguien más. ¿Quién es ese alguien más? Mr. Blanco. Ok. Ok. okay. Entonces aquí ya está completo. Yes. Ok. And the three of you practice the conversation. Eh, yes. Sí, lo primero que hicimos. Ok, great. So you're done, you see. Por eso yo les insisto que sigan las instrucciones para que no se confundan y no trabajen de más, ¿de acuerdo? Sí. Eh, yo sé que les emociona las conversaciones, ¿verdad? Que están acá, pero eh, take it easy, take it easy, so you can do uh -huh, a better work. Ok, so I think that we can get back to the, to the main session room, right? Sí, podemos regresar ya al salón. Ok, uh -huh. check it out and... Let me check if everybody is done. I think that maybe group number two is finished. Okay, give me 10 seconds. Okay. Almost Teacher. done, yes. Uh, the third per, no, the third question. Yes. In the exercise two. Who do you think is going to help Kevin? Uh-huh. Uh, the answers may be um, Mr. Mr. I Reese. think Mr. Reese. Mr. Reese, uh -huh, I think Mr. Only, Reese. Only write Mr. Reese. Yeah, you can say Mr. Reese or I think uh, Mr. Reese. Both uh -huh. are correct. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I think I think Mr. Reese or I think Mr. Reese is going to help Kevin. If you want the full answer, the long answer, okay? Okay, Miss. Reese. This. The four is what does Mr. Reese do on Thursday? Mm -hmm. Um. Um, Albert answers, um, no, Albert says, I'm not so sure. Eso es lo que contesta Albert, I'm mm -hmm. not so sure. Yeah, because Kevin asked, what does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? And Albert answers, I'm not so sure. So here, the answer is, what is the answer? I'm not so sure. Okay, you may say, uh, Albert is not so sure. Albert is not mm -hmm. so sure. Okay. Albert is not so sure. And that's it, yeah? yeah. Albert isn't sure. Uh-huh, yeah. Okay. So shall we get back? Yes. Okay, yes. yes. Okay, let's get back, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for coming back. Ah, oh, Miss Alexandra, hello, welcome. Welcome back to the main session room. You were just captured by the <laughs> hidden camera. Cámara escondida. Perdón, perdón, perdón. No, I am It is Wednesday, so it is the middle of the week. Mitad de semana. It is, okay, kind of hard. Yes, yes. But think tomorrow is Thursday. Ya mañana es jueves, okay? 
and tomorrow payday for you. Yes or no? No. No. Estoy en cierre, mis. Así que es más cansado. Oh, Hasta really? el sábado hay que descansar. No, pero tomorrow is payday. Money, money. Yes or no? Ah, sí. La motivación. Uh -huh. Motivation. What do you like? From money, money. Okay. <laughs> okay. Very well. So here we go. Let's see. Very well. So great. Now it is the time for you to shine. You are the super champions at this moment. I need volunteers. One couple. Uh, maybe, I don't know. I'm going to suggest the volunteers. Maybe Miss Carla Daniela would like to practice. Okay. Okay, Daniela. Mauricio, are you here? <laughs> Mauricio, I need you. Knock, knock, are you here, Mauricio? <laughs> Uh, Miss, can I share my screen? Yes, of what course. Is... Be my guest. Yes. Okay. What do you do? You have to do it on Monday? I just supply my my fabric furniture. Why? Because I knew uh, someone to help me uh, move some boxer. Can you do me a, a, a favor? What is it about? What does uh, Mr. Vidal he do to do die that day, pardon? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Monday? Or when does he he has free time? Uh, I was expecting that you were going to switch roles, but that, that's okay. Okay, two more uh, volunteers, two more volunteers. Dos voluntarios más. Thank you for volunteering. Excellent, great, wow. Ismael, would you like to participate? Reading your conversation with your partner? Ismael, yeah. Ismael, okay, and your partner? Julie, okay, if you want to share the screen, feel free to do it or go ahead like that. Continue así como está, okay? Okay. Este, no sé, eh, Ismael, si la comienza usted o yo. Mm, si gusta yo. Vaya. Eh, what do you have to do on Thursday? Teacher, ¿sería como está ahí o como la habíamos modificado? La que crearon ustedes, su producción. Ah, ok. Ok, okay entonces sería, eh, what do you have to do on Monday? I will make calls to new customer and check social network about the offer sent. Why? Uh, because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What it is about? What does Mr. Villalta have to do that day? I am not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Monday or when does he have free time? Finished teacher. Okay, thank you so much. And now I'm going to read your name. So you say, here I am or present, okay? Abel? Present teacher. 
Okay, great. Alexandra Michel. Present. Eric Vasquez is working. Eric Fernando is working. Eric Ismael. Eric Ismael. Present. Griselda absent. Today Griselda was absent. So sad. Jocelyn. Jose Mauricio. Present. Julissa. Present. Mm. Carla Daniela. Present. Carla Elizabeth absent. Kelly. Here. Present. Okay. Mario. Here I am. Noé. Is Noé here? Oh, yes, of course, forever and ever. Present. Always. Rose. What happened to Rose? She's having problems. Ruth. Ruth, where are you? Here I am, you say. Great. Excellent. Okay, class. Thank you. And only one thing that I want to share with you, class. And it goes like this, okay? Here. What do we have to choose over here? What do or does Albert have to do? Does. What Where does? does? does. Yes. Okay, what does? Hey, what happened here? Is anybody taking my, my screen? Is any of you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it was now, yes, uh -huh, someone was taking my screen. Okay, what does Albert have to do on Thursday? Now, in number two, why do or does Kevin need help? That's very well. And then who do or does you think is going to help Kevin? Do. do. Who do you think? Very well. Now, what do or does Mr. Ruiz do on Thursday? That's, that's what very does? Well. Very well. Okay. Carla Daniela, ask the first question to one of your classmates and he or she has to answer. But don't ask Kelly because she is sick of the throat, okay? She's got COVID. Wait. What does Albert have to do on Thursday? And the question goes to? Noe. Goes to Noe. Um. <laughs> Your dear partner. <laughs> Okay, question number one goes to Noé. He does. No. He does. He just. Uh -huh. he, just he just checks the production uh -huh. for the new product and write a report about it. Okay, report very about it. well. Excellent, very well. Now, question number two. Ruth, Ruth, where are you? Ruth? Why does... Oh, perdón. Tengo que pre uh, preguntarle a alguien, ¿verdad? Yes, yes. You read the question and you say the question goes to... Okay. Abel. Hi. Why does Kevin need help? Okay, because he needs someone to help him move some boxes. Great, very well. Now, question number three. Um, let me see. Probably uh, Ismael, Eric Ismael. 
Are you here? Here. Okay, read the question and say the name of the classmate who is going to answer your question. Question three. Okay. <clears throat> uh, who do you, you think is going to help Kevin? The question goes to? ¿Quién contestará? Eric Ismael. Julissa. Julissa. Hi. Yes. Okay, Eric has question number three for you. Do you have the answer? Mm. Bueno, nosotros le pusimos he's not so sure. Uh, no, is a question number three. Number three. Who do you ah. think is going to help Kevin? Uh, Mr. Reese is going to help Kevin. Excellent. Very well. Now, Alexandra, read question number four and say the name of the classmate. Uh, what do you... What do... Number four, question number four. Okay. Uh, what do you, Mr. Luis? No, 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 no. What do you know? Read question number four. La pregunta número cuatro. Sí. What? What does Mr. Luis do on Thursday? Uh -huh. The question goes to? ¿Para quién es la pregunta? No sé, para... You choose someone. Usted diga quién le va a contestar. No sé, ya pasó Carla. Es que no me acuerdo de los nombres de mis compañeros. Pero sí, no. sí. Es que soy mala, con, soy mala con los nombres. Ok, no sé. ask a... Carla de question. No, no. Ask Carla de question. Ok. Ok. okay. Lo siento, <risa> <laughs> Solo de tu nombre me acordé. <laughs> ok. We don't know. Ok. We don't know. We don't know. Ok. We don't know. Ok. Now here we go. Um, how to use simple present information questions. The information questions are, for example, what does she do on Saturday and Sunday? She visits other companies and has meetings. Fíjense, acá lleva una S y acá cambia, ¿verdad? Porque el verbo es have. I have, you have, he has, she has. Okay? Entonces, acá no le agregamos S, sino que el verbo cambia. Has para tercera persona de singular. Where does he go on? Tuesdays afternoon, he goes to the company's headquarters. ¿Se recuerdan que le, eh, cuando hablábamos de las reglas para los verbos en presente simple, tercera persona del singular, cuando termina en O, we add y es, right? Which department does our boss supervise? Our boss supervises the marketing department. What time does Miguel start to work? Miguel starts to work at nine o'clock. If you pay attention, does is for third person singular, as we have been practicing. And all the questions are for third person singular. Now you have to work on this activity. Create questions with the words provided. You have to organize these words in the correct order to create to build information questions, okay? Let's go over this. You do it individually. Lo hacemos individualmente. And then we're going to share as a class, okay? Let's try. Which is the first word? Follow the, the, the model, okay? Acá no le dan el verbo auxiliar en algunos casos, no le dan el verbo auxiliar. Okay, but all of them, if you notice, are in third person singular. So which is the modal auxiliary verb that we're going to use? Do or does? Okay, yes. very well. So let's build the first one together. Construyamos la primera juntos, okay? 
¿Cuál es la estructura? ¿Se recuerdan que se las mostré al inicio en la, en la, en la presentación? Why? So, why? 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 Even though you don't have here the modal auxiliary, but you know that you have to use it. Por eso es crear preguntas con las palabras que se les proporciona. Pero como ya fue en la primera actividad que hicimos en los breakout rooms, si se recuerdan, construct questions. Yeah, to build questions. That's why I was making emphasis. Questions, questions, okay? Go over and when you are done, you let me know. You tell me, teacher, I'm done. Teacher finished. And then we're going to double check. Finished. Yes? Finished. Okay, yes. here. 
let's go over number two. Tell me, which is the question? Where she processed the payments? Where does, where does, where does she process the payments? Where does she process the payments? payments. And question mark, yeah? Question now mark. in number three. What Ingrid do on Wednesday? What does, Where does Ingrid, Ingrid do Wednesday? Ingrid do on Wednesday. Wednesday. Wednesdays, in plural. Yeah, and the last one. When, when do does, employee? When does? When does? Okay, when does employee acquire the, the raw material? You know the meaning the of raw material, material, right? Raw material, la materia prima. Okay, the raw material. Raw material, la materia prima. Okay, so that's it. Very well. Congratulations. And now, here we go. Let's think about uh, work, okay? So, uh, Carla Daniela, what do you do Saturday morning? Saturday morning. Uh -huh. Thinking about job duties, okay? What do you do Saturday morning? I clean my table. I okay. supervise my public school. Okay, thank you, thank you. Now they, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Now class, what does she do Saturday mornings? What does she do? Uh-huh. She, she prepares her table, yeah, with the fabric, right? And one more activity that she does, she, what does she do? She supervises. Okay, tell them again. What do you supervise, uh, Carla Daniel? My fabric furniture. Okay, she supervises her fabric furniture, right? The fabric, fabric furniture. Okay, now the question goes to, um, let me see, Ruth. Ruth, what do you do Friday? Afternoon. I afternoon. Uh, One activity that you do at work on Friday afternoon. Biblical studies. I. Biblical studies. Estudio bíblico. Yes, but. ¿Usted lo dirige o usted lo recibe? Uh, lo recibo. Ok, I take biblic I study. Take biblic study. Or I study the Bible. Yes, I study the Bible. What I does study she do? The Bible. Hey, what does she do? Friday afternoon. She, she studies, she studies the Bible. Bible. The Bible, the same as everybody. Okay, yes or no? <laughs> Yes. Okay, very well. And now I have a question. Where does Ruth where does Ruth work? She works. Uh-huh. Silence Ruth. Where does she work? She has been telling you. O N G. No O N G. Okay. Very well. No. Hope. Hope. Okay. Hope oh. for families. Okay, very well. Now I have a question. This goes to Alexandra. Alexandra Garcia. Alexandra, what did you practice today in class? What did you practice today in class? ¿Qué practicó hoy en la clase? Mm, practicó Noé, Carla. No, usted, usted, ¿qué es lo que practicó? I ah, practiqué este el ¿cómo se dice? Lo, el diálogo. Ajá. Uh -huh. um, el do y 
el do, do el dash. Ajá. Quiero ver qué más. El what, el when, el where, el we, el who. Why. El who. Why, Why and who. WH information questions. Yes. In simple sí. present. And the question goes to Jose Mauricio. Digamos. Jose Mauricio, what did you practice today in class? ¿Qué practicó hoy en clase? Uh, eh, WH eh, Proxy Conversation. Ok. Eh, quiero ver. So you did you the question is for everybody. Did you practice reading? Yes or no? Yes. Did, did you practice yeah. speaking? Yes. Yes. Did you yes, practice did. writing? Writing? Yes. 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 Did you okay. practice listening to your partners? Yes. yes. Okay, yes. very well. Class, thank you so very much for being here. Ruth, I need you to stay with me 10 minutes. <laughs> Today is your day. <laughs> I didn't say before because, oh, okay, I have to leave my connectivity. Okay. <laughs> have a good night. Sleep well. Sweet dreams. And see you tomorrow. Okay. Bye-bye. Remember bye -bye. the homework. Bye-bye. Take care. See you tomorrow. Okay, Rose, we're going to prepare all your questions or doubts. Okay. <laughs> okay, Ruth. Cuénteme, ¿qué le puedo ayudar del tema que, que estamos viendo ahora? ¿La WH questions or simple present? Y si usted activate your microphone, yo le escucho con todo el gusto del mundo. Oh, lo siento, no, sí. Ok, no problem, Miss. Tell me. Ok. Eh... Quizás con... Eh... When, de con, con, el, con las preguntas. Ajá, por eso se recuerda que yo les insistía. Uh -huh. Tiene que construir las preguntas, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Para la práctica, porque así se les facilita. Pero vamos a retomar acá esta presentación. Vaya, fíjese que tenemos dos usos para what. Más de dos quizás. What lo usamos para hacer preguntas y obtener información sobre algo. Por ejemplo, what is your name? What is your favorite music? What is your hobby? Sí, yo les mm -hmm. quiero obtener esa información. What? Mm -hmm. What is your? En este caso, con el verbo tu bien, presente simple también, ¿verdad? Por mm -hmm. eso, como tenemos acá is, que también es un modal auxiliary, no usamos do or does. ¿Yes? Y porque okay. es your name. What do your name no? What does your name no? What is your name? Okay. También utilizamos what to ask about confirmation or repetition para eh, preguntar acerca de alguna confirmación u, o alguna repetición. Por ejemplo, what is your daily routine? Okay. Mm -hmm. Where? Uh -huh. Where? Donde? Is used to ask about a place or location. Lo usamos para hacer preguntas, ¿verdad? Obtener información sobre un lugar o una ubicación. O where do you live? Where is the market? Where is the supermarket? Where is the bus station? Can, eh, where is the gas station? Where is uh, Torre Futura, for example? Yes, está pidiendo una ubicación. Mm -hmm. ¿Dónde? Where do you live? Where do you study? Where do you work? De un lugar. Who lo utilizamos para personas en singular o en plural. Okay. Who is your boss? Who is your husband? Who is your son? Who is your teacher? Who are your brothers? Who are your sisters? Who are your colleagues? ¿Quiénes son tus colegas? De acuerdo. Why? Porque lo usamos para Construir preguntas acerca de un motivo o una razón. Por ejemplo, uh, why do you work in that company? Why are you late? Why are you happy? Sí, porque estás contenta. 
Y vamos a contestar con because. ¿Sí? Because. Sí, because, sí, que ajá. quiere decir por qué. Uh -huh. Porque acá, por qué, para hacer una pregunta. Why are you late? ¿Por qué llegas tarde? Because I miss the bus. ¿Por qué me dejó el bus? Porque perdí el bus, ¿sí? Entonces, um, estas son, debemos de saber que siempre van al inicio. Why, ¿verdad? Si se fijan, what is your name? Mm -hmm. What is your daily routine? Where do you live? Who is your boss? Why do you work in that company? ¿Ok? Entonces, tenemos acá y retomando nuestro manual. Acá. Las tenemos estructuradas con tercera persona. Fíjense, what, where, which, and what. Which es cuál, pero esa la vamos a profundizar mañana porque which lo utilizamos cuando tenemos eh, que seleccionar algo, pero nuestras opciones son limitadas. Which is your favorite color? Black or white? ¿Cuál es su color favorito? Black or white? Solo dos opciones. Yes. Pero cuando yo le pregunto, what is your name? ¿Cuántos nombres existen en el mundo? Uh, infinidad. Entonces, por eso no decimos, which is your name? Pero si yo le digo, uh, which is your name? ¿Carla Daniela o Carla Elizabeth? Porque solo hay dos opciones, ¿sí o no? Cuando uh -huh. si me llego a confundir, ¿verdad? Porque Entonces, hay en este caso, no tendría que decir cuál es tu name, Carla, Elizabeth o, o Daniela. No, no tendría que decir. No, así. como no, podría decir ah. what. Ah, no, en ese caso sería which, which porque solo ¿verdad? tengo dos opciones. Okay. Porque ya estoy siendo específica, ¿sí? Uh -huh. Pero si yo solo le pregunto, what is your name? Ay, no le doy opciones y puede ser un hombre italiano, puede ser un hombre coreano, qué sé yo, o nombres exóticos como los que se ponen ahora, ¿verdad? Eh, las Ajá. celebridades, sí. Eh, eh, vida, luna, norte, qué sé yo. Ok, en <risa> inglés y en español. Entonces, uh, esa es la diferencia entre what y which, pero mañana la okay. vamos a profundizar. Ahora se la estoy adelantando. Okay. Lo que quiero que note es que todas las WH information questions, ok, o WH question words, van al inicio, ¿sí? Uh -huh. Esa es la estructura. En este caso, Ruth, estamos viendo en tercera persona de singular, por eso el auxiliar es das. Okay. ¿Sí? Okay. Pero cuando contestamos en afirmativo, no utilizamos el verbo auxiliar, sino que el sujeto de la oración y el verbo con el cambio en presente simple. Cuando el verbo termina en O, le agregamos ES, igual que cuando termina con SH, washes, mm -hmm. she washes her car, mm -hmm. He watches TV, con CH, al igual que O le agregamos ES y a la mayoría le agregamos una S, ¿sí? Estamos. What does she do on Saturday and Sunday? Acá estoy preguntándole a usted sobre alguien más, no sobre usted. Por eso, she visits other companies and has meetings, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Esta es la rutina que esa persona realiza, ¿sí? Más sin embargo, lo que estuvimos viendo ayer, acá no es con das, es con do. Uh -huh. Es decir, recuerde que do lo utilizamos con I, you, we, they. ¿okay? Y recordemos siempre, siempre que das, he, she, it. ¿okay? So uh -huh. we have, what do I do? Where do you work? When do we go to meetings? How do they plan the marketing? What time do you take breakfast? Esta expresión, what time, puede ser sustituida por when. When do you take breakfast? En algunos libros lo puede encontrar o escuchar que alguien no le va a decir what time do you take breakfast? Alguien le puede decir when do you take breakfast? Y es lo mismo, ¿sí? Uh -huh. Es el mismo significado, ¿de acuerdo? Uh -huh. Muy bien. Um, veamos qué más, qué más. Por eso ayer practicamos creando estas preguntas. ¿Sí se recuerda? Uh -huh. I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Eso es una rutina, una acción repetitiva. Por eso es what, 
do I do? Or what do you do? What do you do? Recuerde que what, que como le expliqué en la tabla, se utilizaba para hacer preguntas sobre confirmación o también para eh, preguntar sobre un hábito o rutina, algo que se hace constantemente. ¿De acuerdo? Uh -huh. Bien. Um, what else? Y acá que tuvimos la práctica. Acá, what do you have to do on Thursday? Acá es una pregunta directa. Do you? What do you? ¿Verdad? Por eso, como te la estoy haciendo la pregunta a ti directamente, uso do, porque el sujeto es you. Pero sin embargo, acá tenemos los dos. Mire, what does Mr. Ruiz? Mr. Ruiz es tercera persona de singular. No te estoy preguntando a ti. A ti te pregunto sobre él. Someone else's routine. Y acá se cumple. Ask questions about someone else's duties at workplace. Sobre las actividades u obligaciones que tiene alguien más en el trabajo. ¿verdad? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not sure. No estoy seguro. Entonces tenemos acá. What do you? En singular. Segunda persona. Y acá. What does Mr. Ruiz? Tercera persona de singular, utilizamos das. ¿Ok? Sí, ya sí. estamos un poquito más claros. Sí, sí, la verdad es que, que ahí estaba yo como un poco confundida uh -huh. con el do y el das. Ok, sí, porque uh -huh. recuerde que en las yes, no questions solo utilizábamos das. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. Quizás por eso un poquito la confusión. Por ejemplo, si yo le digo... Uh, do you like uh, do you like to do you like pizza yes I do no I don't era más fácil uh -huh. sí pero ahora utilizamos das y la WH question esa es la diferencia entre las information questions and yes no questions ok uh -huh. ok, okay perfecto well. creo que esa es la, la también eh, ver qué es la, eh, la respuesta, no, las preguntas de sí o no y las, las preguntas Information. De, de información. información. Correcto, ahí está la clave. Ok, okay. very well. <laughs> Thank you for staying those 10 minutes with me, ok? I appreciate that. So, if you don't have any other questions, Gracias thank you very much. También. And see you tomorrow. Trate de ir haciendo las tareas, ¿verdad? Y si tiene duda, pues me pregunta, ok? No Ay, problem. Siéntase muy bien de hacer la pregunta en la clase porque así usted está ayudando a los demás porque probablemente no es usted la única que tiene esa duda. Ya se dio cuenta en los breakout rooms, ¿verdad? Sí, y sí, ahí claro. por eso yo les insisto, no corran hacia algo más claro que le llama más la atención la conversación. Pero no, primero vamos pasito a pasito. No, ¿okay? Yo hoy creo que estaba un poco distraída, estando súper cansada y casi yes, que no está duermo. Yeah, yes, <risa> pero más que todo es pues, siento que no le entendí las indicaciones. Ok, pues, but, ajá. pero no, ahora sí ya. Entiendo, sí, sí ya, ¿verdad? Ok. <risa> Thank you very Bye much. Tonight. Have a good night. Sleep well. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.